What is a servitor? A servitor is a mental entity specifically created by someone to perform a set range of tasks. Servitors can be created to perform a wide range of tasks from specific to general, and in the case of an artist, your servitor will be formed to help facilitate an effective and enveloping creative process. In the book, Flow Experience, Empirical Research and Applications, Joanne Keller states, it has been established that in order to experience flow, a key dimension is to match between a person's skill and the task's challenges. This means in order to keep yourself in the flow state in producing good art, you have to keep pushing your abilities and learning new tools and skills. The challenge is to do something that is not too easy but not too hard, so that your brain doesn't get bored too quickly. Flow involves flexibility and ease. Everything works harmoniously and effortlessly. By forming a separate mental state to create, you can effectively fine-tune your workflow and creative toolset down to a fine point. Every time you plan to create, focus on that part of your mind very hard even before you open up a new project file or lay down a new canvas. Put on the same style of music every time. Make your lights the same color every time. Light the same scented candle or incense and get in the zone so your servitor can emerge. Know that your only purpose in the world right now is to create this piece of art you are working on and that it is an amazing piece of work. Know that you are using your creative energy to serve you through the medium of your choice to express yourself to the world. Research suggests that if you can cultivate the flow in your daily life, the benefits just don't stop at job performance. The flow state of mind also contributes to health and well-being. But as soon as we try to bottle up that feeling and carrying it into less appealing tasks, it seems to elude us. Rather than getting in the flow, we end up disengaged and working harder than ever on work we just don't appreciate. Use that servitor when you are doing tasks you do care about so that you can cultivate it to be the strongest and most effective tool in your creative arsenal. When you tap into your servitor, you lose the negative weight of your ego holding you back on your creative process. It allows you to silence the negative voice in your head telling you your art isn't good enough or how you're an imposter. Those thoughts don't exist in your servitor's mind. Those emotions can't hold you back once you fully embrace your creative servitor. However, evidence regarding the better performance and flow situations is mixed. No doubt, the association between the two is a reciprocal one. That is, flow experiences may foster better performance, but on the other hand, good performance makes flow experience more likely. Results of a longitudinal study in the academic context indicate that the casual effect of flow on performance is only of small magnitude, and the strong relationship between the two is driven by an effect of performance on flow. In the long run, flow experiences in a specific activity may lead to higher performances in that activity as the flow is positively correlated with a higher subsequent motivation to perform and to perform well. By creating the art you want to create, it forces you into the flow state faster and makes it easier for you to tap into it at will. And by practicing getting into the flow state, it makes it easier to create meaningful content and trains the brain to experience less friction when problem solving in any situation. Learn to accept the mental state of communicating with your servitor, and I promise you that the results you see from your creative efforts will grow exponentially. If you made it to this point in the video, thank you so, so much for actually watching and listening to me ramble in this manner. 
let me know what you think of this format, if you like it, if you don't like it, what I should change. If you're not subscribed, please do that, and check out all my art on social media with the link in the description below. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Go out there and create some art.